first armed and dangerous. Right now, the search is on for this guy accused of terrorizing people across three counties. We are talking about carjackings, shootings, and most recently in Thanona Sassa. But the suspect could be anywhere. That's why Nightside's reporter Josh Shadorowitz is staying on top of this information for you. Josh, the suspect already shot at one person, so police think he's not afraid to do this again. Right, Katie, and luckily he missed the first time there. All right, let's walk you through how this all started. It began with detectives say he stole a Cadillac in Orlando this morning. He was then spotted about an hour later by deputies as he drove through Polk County before he wound up right here. And that is where detectives say he ditched that Cadillac near the Thedona Sasser Road exit in Hillsboro. That is when he tried to then steal a parked truck nearby, but the man who owned that truck, oh no, he did not go down without a fight. I did chase him down. George Ballin was working construction in a nearby subdivision when his truck was swiped. I don't know where he came from. He was running. He jumped in one of my trucks and took off with it. So Ballin hopped in another truck and went after him. They wound up at this Marathon gas station on Thanota Sassa just off the highway. The bullet holes left behind in the sheet metal tell the rest of the story. I pulled right in front of him um, and he pulled out a gun and started shooting. Three times, luckily, all hit this truck. He's obviously uh, shown that he has the uh, intention of using that firearm, and it's just by the grace of God this guy wasn't shot. All right, so I know the picture here is not great, but take one more good look because that is the guy who police are searching for. He drove off in George's other pickup. It's a green 2002 Ford F-150, which he could still very well be driving right now, Catalina, and again, armed and believed to be dangerous. So we need to find this guy. You can help investigators by sharing this story from our 10 News WTSP Facebook page.